In the power struggle over Venezuela, the self-proclaimed interim president Guaido is to be deprived of his immunity. In the face of continuing power failures, President Maduro dismissed his Minister of Energy. The self-proclaimed Venezuelan interim president Juan Guaido threatens the withdrawal of his immunity. Chief Justice Michael Moreno called on pro-government MPs to lift their protection against prosecution. Guaido should be prosecuted for having recently violated an imposed exit ban, explained Moreno. He is close to President Nicolas Maduro. The opposition leader is also accused of inciting violence against the government and accepting illegal funds in the context of street protests. The appeal of Judge Moreno was addressed to the government loyal constituent assembly, to which Maduro has delegated the powers of the opposition-controlled parliament. As president of parliament Guaido enjoys immunity. This rejected the Supreme Court and the constituent assembly as unlawful in a reaction. Venezuelan security forces have already arrested Guaido's chief of staff but have not acted against the opposition leader himself. In his claim to power Guaido is supported by the United States and about 50 other countries, the Maduro re-election 2018 is a farce. In addition to the political and economic crisis, people in Venezuela have been experiencing power outages almost every day since 7 March. In addition, there are often impairments in the water supply and in public transport. The school lessons have been suspended for almost a week. Maduro dismissed his energy minister, military general Luis Mota Dominguez. As successor, the president appointed the engineer Igor Gavidia Leon. This has 25 years of experience, said Maduro on state television.